Hey guys, welcome back to Glenna's World of Coloring. Said that really weird. Anyway, today I wanted to do a coloring chat out of Color by Number Animals, or Animal Stencils. Love this book. I don't know what I'd do without this book. Probably be sad. Alright. So, I've chosen a page. We're gonna do the sugar glider. So, let me zoom you in some. Let's see, so number three is where we're starting on the face. And, uh, actually, that looks like it, that's all is on the face. So, dark brown, E342. I see it right there. Okay. E342 is chocolate. I'm gonna zoom you in a little bit more. There we go. All right. So, how is everyone? Good, I hope. Uh, I'm all right today. I actually went to um, the place that I put in a job for and filed my paperwork. So officially, I have the job. I start on Monday and I work Wednesday and Friday. So that being said, me working Monday, Wednesday and Friday, that's my upload days. So, I guess I'm going to have to just record the videos tomorrow, which is Saturday, and upload them through the week. That's what we're going to have to do, because there's no way around it. <laughs> um, so, I go in on Monday. Well, yeah, Monday I can record a regular video, but Wednesday and Friday I have to work the night shift. So that won't be that's not it's not possible to upload that day or those days unless i pre-record so that's what i'm gonna do okay number four brown e262 let's see 262 there it is if i can get a hold of her Alright. E262 is tan. Oh. <coughs> Ooh. Well, that came out of nowhere. Uh. Alright. What did I have for five? One eight. Okay. Because this one's called tan. I don't know why I didn't just use this one for the actual color tan. I have no idea. <laughs> I guess I'm not that smart. But anyway. Yeah. Finally, I got a job again. I won't be just at the, ha just at the house all day every day anymore. Um, so that's good. <clears throat> I mean, really, there's not, not much for me to do um, besides just lay around and eat and play games. You know, I don't want to do that all day. Um, so it's good that I'm getting out and actually doing something. But, huh, first day, I've got to do all the computer crap, all the things about, like, tobacco and, um, I guess, like, store stuff, you know, all that good stuff when you start working at a retail store. 
I've probably already done that stuff a hundred times. But, you know, that's just how it is. That's just what you gotta do. And uh, at this place, you used to have to wear polos, polo shirts. But they changed it so you can just wear regular shirts. My regular store color shirts. Which, thank God, <laughs> I don't like polos. I think they're ugly. Um, just not a fan of polos. And like boot cut pants, oh my God. I hate them. I hate them. I, they, I don't like the way that they feel, you know? Like me wearing them and just the little openings at the bottom. I don't like it. I don't like it. So that's why I wear like tighter fitting pants, like skinny jeans. I love those. I mean, because I don't have to worry about stepping on my pant legs if they're too big. I used to, I used to deal with that, but now I don't have to. I bought a new pair today because there was a tear in um, the back of the pants, not the butt, but um, like where the belt loops are, right underneath those is where it tore. And I was like, how in the world did that happen? I still don't know. I still don't know. That's just how it is. This is just how it is. But those are my favorite kinds, and I just had to have some. And then I seen at Walmart that they got crop top sweaters, and I'm like, mm, gotta get one. <laughs> Not this week, maybe next week. Got a new album today from someone that's in a band that I like. They're solo for now until their military service is over. But he just came out with this album not long ago. And I saw it today and I was like, mm, that is now mine. I'm happy about it too. It's the cute, it's a cute little album. He's got his dog on the front and everything. Uh, when I start working, I'm gonna take my own money with me. Usually, my parents will give me a few dollars to. Um, buy food and drink but you know I gotta buy random junk you know I got to so I'm gonna use my own money for that for my own shenanigans <laughs> uh, like those mini brands oh my god I love those mini brands I had a co-worker when I used to work at uh, my first job, my first company, um, I used to have a co-worker and she would always buy those mini brands and she was like 40, 50. She loved them. I miss her. But she, she was smart and she got out of there before I did. Okay, number five is 10. So that's E189. Let me find it. Oh, there, there it is. Oh, come on. All right. E189, thin persimmon. <sighs> but I thank God that I did get out of that place. 
Oh shoot, that is a good color for a sugar glider. But yeah, thank him every day that I was fortunate enough to get out of that crap hole. And the one that I worked at first, that manager isn't even there anymore. Would you get out of here, Nat? Jesus. I was talking to the manager up at um, the place that I'm working now. I was talking to her while I was f doing my paperwork. And there was a gnat flying around and she's just like, hit me if you got to, just get rid of it. I was like, it was flying around your head, I don't want to hit your head. She's like, do it anyway. I was like, well. But they're the kind of people that joke around and have a good time. Now they're serious about work. I am too, you know, but we'll, we can still have a good time. She, she said one of her managers is a workaholic. She'll, get, she'll have you running all over the place making sure you get work done, which is good. Thank God that they actually care to do their work. The other place sure didn't. So if that place wanted work done, they would have been letting us do a lot more than what we were doing. Let's see. Um, last night, I had the weirdest freaking dream. Uh, but yesterday, I was looking at a bunch of spiders, like tarantulas, that I could sell in my pet store. So I was looking at a bunch. And then last night, when I went to bed, I had a dream that I had a box of tarantulas in my room for whatever reason. I guess I was keeping them. I guess I was, t I guess they were my pets. But I opened the box for whatever reason and they all got out. So they were just all around the room. And I was like, hmm, that's unfortunate. And I just left them alone. I just let them, I just let them be. I don't know, it is a strange dream. Guess that's what you get when you're looking at spiders for a while. <clears throat> huh. All right. I don't know why I had that dream. Don't know. More than likely because I was looking at those pictures. But there is some really pretty tarantulas that I'm going to sell. There's one called a green bottle tarantula. It is so pretty. Uh, one's called a A goatee sapphire. G O T T Y. It is gorgeous. Um, but yes. But I'm really excited about that store. I don't know whether I'll have it in Berea or Richmond, maybe even London. Um, but I'm just really excited.
shoot. I'm gonna be making $9.50 an hour working where I'm about to work. I'm excited. That's way, that's more than I worked at the first place. Uh, and I'll probably get a raise if I do really good. So. Yeah, I'm excited. <laughs> I'm gonna make some good food later. I'm gonna make us some macaroni and tomato juice. God almighty. And you take your elbow pasta, you cook it. When it's done, you drain the water and put you in a can of rolled gold tomato juice. Mm. It is so good. Love it. I could make that and eat that for days. <laughs> Let me get a drink right quick in my festive Starbucks cup. Mm. Mm -mm. I'm drinking iced coffee that I just made in the pot. I actually have an iced coffee maker. It's not much different than a, than a regular like coffee maker. Not at all really. Um, you just brew your coffee, let it go into your cup, then you put ice in it and put your creamer. That's about it. That's the only thing that's really different. Other than that, it's not different at all. But I love it. <laughs> I actually got it for Christmas, I believe, like last year or the year before because I was like oh I want a I want an iced coffee maker and there we go I got one from my mama and then I went to Walmart and I found it and it was like 20 bucks I was like oh okay let's see hopefully this year I don't know. I never really know what I want until I see what I want. And then I'm like, ooh, I like that. And then I forget what it was. I'm like a moron. I went to the Dollar Tree uh, to get some freeze-dried fruit for my rabbit. And they didn't have anything except a bag of sugar because the fruit all had a lot of sugar and she can't have that and then there was freeze-dried bananas which she does not like <laughs> okay number nine is orange nine yr 495 there it is right there <clears throat> YR-495, salmon. Let's see. That's number nine. <clears throat> That's what I just said. All right. Today is, uh, is September the 15th. Not much longer until we can start doing Halloween pictures. So probably every video that I make during the Halloween season will be a Halloween picture whether I get that off of the internet or whether it's in a coloring book you know we'll we'll get her and I can buy some stuff for next month so I'll probably order like a Halloween color by number maybe and that'll be fun now while I'm working I'm gonna try to keep it 
the same days that I upload. I'm gonna try. I'm gonna really try. Uh, I know I've missed days already because I didn't want to record or I was tired or I'd been out all day and actually couldn't. <clears throat> but I'm going to try to be on point every week. So when I get off of here, I'm going to look for Halloween coloring books. <clears throat> Excuse me. Hopefully I can find some good ones. I may buy more than one. Maybe two. No more than two though because I've got so many books that I need to color in. Shoot. I just remembered I was going to color out of my Jane Madej book. Well, it's too late now. <laughs> We're already halfway through this picture. We'll do that Monday. Well, technically Monday. I'm going to record my videos for next week, tomorrow. She asked if I wanted to start this weekend. And I was like, no, I got to get shirts. Because I don't have any shirts for work. We got to have red shirts, so got to go to Walmart tomorrow and get some. Oh, my God. Yeah, uh, today at Walmart, um, I was checking out. I was getting my stuff ready, um, and I had scanned... I'd scanned my album first, then, um, no, 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 no. <laughs> I scanned my printer first, and I was, um, entering the serial number because that's what it asked for. And this older woman that worked there come up. And she's like, oh, do you need help? I'm like, no, I'm just entering the serial number for this printer because that's what it's asking for. And then she covers the number with her finger. I'm like, oh, it's under your finger there, the serial number. And she's like, oh, that's this is what you need to scan, da da da. And I'm like, oh, it's under your finger. And so she keeps on and then we finally get it through her thick skull that we needed a number that was on the box not the barcode so she read me the the serial number and i was like oh thanks uh we're good now and she stood there the whole freaking time i was scanning stuff and then started putting my groceries in a buggy. I was like, I can do it myself. That's what I was thinking. Like, I can do it myself. Thank you. And then uh, my dad started scanning grocery, or yeah, scanning stuff to put up. And she was like, oh, you want me to put your bags in this buggy? I was like, no, thank you. I was like, no, I got it, thanks. And she stood there the whole time. And then I scanned my fruit. I bought a star fruit, which is so good. Go and try some star fruit if you've got it in your area, in, a, in your Walmart. It is so good. Um, but we scan the star fruit, it rings up a dollar ninety-eight. And it's supposed to be sixty-eight cents. So I'm like, oh ma'am, uh, this is ringing up wrong. 
Could you change the price for us? So she starts trying to do that. And she keeps scanning her ID badge. So we're getting frustrated at this point. Okay, so 10 is yellow, orange, YR596. Let me find it. Oh, there it is. YR596, cadmium yellow. <clears throat> but at this point, we're getting a little frustrated because, you know, she wasn't doing anything right. She just kept messing up, and eventually somebody else sees that my dad is mad, and she comes over. She's like, oh, is everything all right? And I'm like, well, this rung up wrong. We just needed to fix the price, and she uh, brings it up on her phone, and she's like, oh, my phone isn't working, and she tries it on a different one, and she's like well let me uh, scan that barcode with this app for a second so she does that and she's like well it's not even on there and I'm like oh, it's alright we'll just pay for it and I don't know that place was having a crappy day today apparently Jesus I need to get a different color for yellow orange because it, they're like the same color apparently. I should probably I could probably do 394 next time. More than likely that's what I'll do. Um or like Y697, something different than this. Let me go ahead and change it. Um, let's see. All right. I'm gonna go ahead and change this color because it's just the same color. Let's go for YR394. Uh, Make sure it's not already on here. Okay. Y R three ninety four. But that woman, oh my God, <laughs> was not competent in that job. Um. I don't know what happened that uh, today, but it shoot it was just annoying she wouldn't go away ah and you know we tried to be as nice as we could but eventually you know you're gonna get mad you're gonna get pissed because people are not even doing the right thing And dad was definitely getting mad, you know? And I was doing everything right, you know? I asked, oh, can you change this price? And she couldn't even do that. You know, and then when you're there getting something, you expect the price to be right. You don't expect something that was supposed to be 69 cents or 68 cents to be a dollar 98, you know? That's stupid.
that's over a dollar more. But you, you know, you just don't expect that. You expect the prices to be correct. And I know, because I used to work at a store that had people complaining and griping and fussing all day, every day, you know. I'm probably subjecting myself to more of that by working for this store. But, you know, it, it is what it is, you know. It, I say, you know, way too much. Um, but this store is, like, literally five minutes from my house. Not even that. Probably, like, two or three. So, it's, like, the perfect, the perfect thing. Okay, go down here to the tail. Shoot, I bought 80 something dollars worth of stuff today. Yep. I got a 20 in, um, in my wallet or my coin purse. I don't use my wallet to put money in. But, um, yeah, I've still got a 20. And I'm gonna use that at work, you know, to buy stuff to eat and drink. Hopefully they've got um, better stuff to choose from than the other place that I worked. Um, because all that I ate when I worked at the other place was just crap. Um, yeah. Shoot, I was gonna buy a can opener today because I bought um, cans of kernel corn for a snack because it's pretty healthy and I like corn, so yeah, I didn't get a can opener. Okay, number 19 is pink. So that is R295, R295, let's see, there's 293, hmm, oh there it is, R295, dark blush, got a couple pinks. This video has gone by pretty fast. We're only 35 minutes in almost. And I'm almost done with the picture. Which is cool. Shoot, I love this book though. I'm gonna have to get more Sun Life drawing books. I might do that next month. Get another one. Because I just, I love it. I love it. But I've been diamond painting a lot recently. Uh, I got a new one the last time I ordered stuff from Amazon. It's two bunnies. I'll have to show you. Um, 
when it's finished not right now I'll have it finished probably by the end of the month because it's I'm almost finished with it anyway and I need to get more diamond paintings uh, I did get two when I ordered stuff one was a hedgehog and the one was two bunnies so I have to show those off when they're finished no oh. the rabbit went into the into its box and it's sleeping But uh, that my boss now, she said that there's this old man that comes in all the time wanting like cigars. And um, the he is just really rude. Like my brother said, if there's somebody that comes by up behind him to check out, he'll be like, excuse me, can you back up six feet? Like the mandates are still in place or something. I don't know. Which they're not. Um, not here where I am. They're very much lifted, as far as I know. I wish I would have used a different, a different yellow orange, so that it wouldn't all look the same. That's okay. I changed it for next time. Oh, guys, guess what? We are so close to kind of getting monetized. Well, we're close to being able to have a membership with like badges and perks and all that cool stuff. Maybe exclusive giveaways. You never know. That would be really cool though. Like once a month exclusive giveaways. Oh, that would be so neat. The deal still stands though. We get to 500 subscribers. I'll do um, a giveaway. We'll, we will be doing international. I've changed my whole mind. Yep. We're going to make it international as well. <clears throat> Wherever you live, I will ship it. Okay. <clears throat> Last but not least, number 20 is Violet V289. Um, let's see. 289. All right. Oh, 289 Mentha Piperita. And this is our last color. I'm excited to start doing Halloween stuff. I need to start working on my book some more, my coloring book. If anyone's interested in just buying the snake picture that I showed in a previous video, um, 
not sure exactly what video that was. I think it was my, hmm, the one before the vintage seed packets, I think. But if anyone wants that one, you know, a dollar maybe, just let me know in the comments if you would want that page. I may try to sell it on Etsy for like a dollar. <laughs> Like 99 cents. <laughs> That'd be a way I could make money for the channel. None of that would go into my pocket. It would all go back into the channel. Oh, and I could even sell it on Amazon, maybe. I don't know. I'll have to figure that out when it's done. I wish I had a different place to put my lamp. It's like right above where the book is. Well, not like above, like in the, in the air. It's literally like over here on my desk, right close up to the book. It's really bright. It's giving me a headache. I want one of those, um, one of those hanging lights that you can get. What? Like a clip-on light. I don't know. I confuse myself. But I do need to figure out what I'm doing tomorrow. I know I need to make videos for Wednesday and Friday. Okay, this might work. I could do Mondays on Monday since you know, I don't have to work at night. And then I could do um, Wednesdays on Tuesday. And then Fridays on Thursday. That would work. She even said at the job that me and my brother would probably work together eventually, like on the same shift, which would be neat. <laughs> he probably wouldn't like it because I would be bothering him, but it is what it is. He can get over it.
And I did let her know that I could work anytime as long as I had a ride home. Because my dad works really late at night up into the morning. He works until like 1.30 in the morning. Usually gets home at 2. So he gets home really, really late. done. I'll probably, all right, probably do the Jane Madej book tomorrow. Not tomorrow, freaking Monday. Okay. All right. That is it. Our sugar glider is done. So, if you enjoyed the video, leave a like, comment, subscribe, hit the notification bell to get notified when I upload new videos. That's a lot of fun. <laughs> and yes, I'll see you guys in the next video. See you guys.